As you have written over the decades about finance, you've written about uh, the, the, the latest book on the, the, the frequent trading and that flash boys right. and all that, the big short with all of its acclaim. When you look at all these books, it comes up to the shock of our new president elect. <laughs> the Michael Lewis view of how America and particularly American finance will adapt and adjust to the certitude of Mr. Trump. And I would suggest it's a certitude that's not in this book. These guys were the ultimate anti-certitude, weren't they? Yes, they were. They, they, mean, they, these guys never went like this. No. They never did this. <laughs> no, they didn't. They also didn't put a pencil between their teeth like that. They never would have done that. That happens after the and, fifth uh, hour. But, but the, the so the, the, I tell you what, they would have looked at Trump and they would have said, like he doesn't, uh, they would have been terrified, I think. Uh, and they would have, they, they, their work, at the center of their work, is an, a keen awareness of the fallibility of the human mind. Mm -hmm. And it's not shameful. It's like we are wired to make certain kinds of mistakes. We need to understand that so we can correct for them. If you think you're, if you go through life thinking you're kind of infallible and your gut instinct is so great, you're going you're gonna to commit horrible mistakes. You're prone to them. And so that would have been the first thing I think they would have said is they would have said, this guy, he's dangerous because he doesn't even realize that. He's dangerous for other reasons, too. It's also, look, how the financial markets get their mind around Trump, I think it's going to be an impossible task because at the same time he is certain about everything, he's totally unpredictable. I mean, he's a, he's a, he, I mean, basically, at the bottom of this is a weird dude. And I don't know what the weird dude's going to do. And I don't think anybody's going to be able to kind of predict it either.